everyone it's Nati again I wanted to do my intro to the pan those eyeshadows for 2023 um, so I want to start just by recapping 2022 so I started that project last year um, I figured it was a good way to kind of test out all my eyeshadows try and use because I have a lot of palettes <laughs> try and use as many shades as possible and just kind of be able to play with different colors that I might otherwise not choose. So it was a good way to do that. Um, I did find that it was frustrating to have four shades along with all my eyeshadow projects. So that's the first thing I'm gonna change this year is I'm gonna do three shades. And then um, I did keep track of how many times I used it and I did 20 uses per each. <sighs> I think I can still do that, 20 uses, because I'm going down a shade, so that should be easy. 20 uses or hit pan. Um, some, obviously, that were brand new shades, it's hard to go ahead and hit pan on those. Some of them, it's hard to get those 20 uses. So, I don't know, we'll see how it goes, but I think three shades will be easier to handle than four, along with my other projects and I am trying to pan a palette from the beginning of the year so that's going to be consuming a lot of my time but I still want to use you know this project and then the project level up which I'm still stuck on level one but an uptake coming for that soon but uh I had a lipstick on my teeth um so anyways for this year um I want to do three shades 20 uses or hit pan and then I also want to keep track. Um, that's one of the things. Because I was good at keeping track each time that I would, you know, roll a new one. I would keep track how many times I used it. But then I deleted it from my app and didn't write it elsewhere. So I want to keep track year-wide. Um, so after I delete from my phone, I want to keep it in a notebook. Just so that at the end of the year, I can look back and say how many shadows I used in this project and then how many of those um, I hit pan on because I think that would be interesting to see because I know I hit pan on some this year but I didn't keep track of the numbers so I don't know. So anyways let's go ahead and roll um, the first palette. Actually I'm going to roll all of the palettes. Um, I'll show you which ones I am rolling but I'm going to roll all of them and then go get them. So first palette here we go. Let's see what we get. Uh, I just used this one, so I am going to re-roll because I want to pick. So that's another rule. I can re-roll if it's a palette I just recently used because I want to make sure some of my other palettes um, get love. And then if it's something that's too similar in my pan, that palette, which is the Too Faced um, Pumpkin Spice. If it's something dissimilar to that, then I'm going to re-roll. So here we go. Oh, Natasha Denona Love Palette. Okay. Natasha. So that'll be the first palette. So I'm going to reset it so you can see that I've reset the wheel. And then we're going to roll the second eyeshadow palette. And we're getting... Oh, I just used this one. Gosh. Okay, we're going to re-roll. Sorry. <laughs> Bronze. I just used the bronze too. What in the world? Okay. Give me a palette I haven't used in a while. Ah, oh, Kyla Le Jardin. So I haven't used that one at all. So I'm glad that came up. I wonder if I should make like um a wheel that has all the palettes that haven't been loved on. So anyways, we're going to reset that and hopefully I won't have to re-roll again. If I get a palette I just used, then we're just going to go with it because, oh, Sydney Grace and Temptalia. I haven't used that one in a while. Okay, I'm going to go get those palettes. And I'll... Okay, I'm back. I did bring um, my Pan That Palette because I want to make sure the colors aren't very similar. So this is what the Pan That Palette will look like. Sorry, I can't find my light. Okay, let's put that aside. So 
So the first one was the Natasha Denona Love Palette. This one I believe has been discontinued, but it looks like this. It's a lot of like pinky, purpley colors. So let's see how many we have. One, two, three, four, five. Times. Okay, let me see. So it has 15 shades. So let me go to my app. Edit. One, two, 15. God. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna generate the random number. So we got 12, so that's gonna be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Ooh, okay, okay. So that one's gonna be this dark purplish reddish shade here. So we're gonna do passion and I'll probably Depot this one and put it with my singles just because it's easier than having a bunch of palettes. So we're going to do that. Um, then the next one was Kylove. And this is one that I have yet to use. So it is brand new. And this one has three, nine shades. So we are going to one through nine. And we are going to generate five. Okay. 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 That's, that's going to be interesting. <laughs> okay. So the one I generated was this one. And I'll swatch these at the very end. That mint shade right in the middle. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five. Yep. Okay. That'll, that'll be interesting. And then my last one is Sydney Grace, and I believe this one has 15. So this one looks like this. And I do have a pan. No, I don't have a pan, but I did pull Umbra the first time I did the pan those eyeshadows. So there is a nice dip in there, but one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve. So we have twelve. So oh god, my nose itches. So let's generate the number. That's so random. 10. Okay. <laughs> 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay, that one's pretty basic. Okay, I can work with that. Let me just double check. None of these are in my Too Faced. I don't think that one is, but. No, that should be fine. Actually, these should all be fine, so that'll be good. Okay, so let me swatch the colors. So that one's from Sydney Grays, kind of a taupey brown. Um, this one is from Kylove. <laughs> Very bright for winter, but okay, whatever. We'll roll with it. And then the Natasha Denona is the opposite end of the spectrum, and it's actually going to be a darker shade. So that's what we're working with. Um, not too bad, actually. I mean, there's a couple colors there, but I think I can work with these with the Pumpkin Spice Too Faced palette. Um, so this is exciting. Um, we're going to work with these, and then I will update once a month to see how I'm doing. Again, like I've said, I will work on 20 uses or hitting pan, and then I will try to keep track, not just on my phone and then deleting, but actually keep it in a notebook. So um, yeah, wish me luck, and we'll see how this goes, and I will see you next time. Bye.